Hi, I'm Dr. Richard Usatine, Associate Editor of the Journal of Family Practice and Column Editor of Photo Rounds. I am a Professor of Family Medicine, Dermatology, and Cutaneous Surgery at the University of Texas Health Science Center in San Antonio. I am also the Medical Director of the University Skin Clinic. Today we will demonstrate electrosurgical procedures. Electrosurgery is an important modality for dermatologic procedures. It can be used without anesthesia for small cosmetic procedures or with anesthesia to stop the bleeding during skin surgery. It can also be used to destroy skin cancers with electrodesiccation and curettage. We will demonstrate all of these procedures. A sharp-tipped disposable electrode is used to eradicate multiple small cherry angiomas on the chest. The power setting is 2.1 watts on low. Watch how the red color disappears as the cherry angioma is eradicated. Facial telangiectasias can be treated with electrosurgery using the disposable sharp tip electrode with a power setting of 2.0 watts on low. The electrode is touched gently to a portion of the telangiectasia and the button on the handpiece is carefully pressed. Treatment may also be performed using a sharp epilation needle with a similar power setting. The handpiece should be stabilized so that it does not move when the button is pressed. As this procedure is done without local anesthesia, the patient will feel the electrical impulse, which often leads to a facial grimace and some tearing of the eye. Note how the telangiectasias become less visible after treatment. After the elliptical excision of a basal cell carcinoma, the hyphricator with a sterile sharp tip electrode is being used to stop the bleeding. Each bleeder is electrocoagulated and the cotton gauze is used to dry the bleeding areas for better visualization of the pinpoint bleeders. The power setting is 18 watts on low. A sterile sheath is covering the hand control pencil. A squamous cell carcinoma in situ was diagnosed with a shave biopsy at the previous visit. The procedure begins with local anesthesia using 1% lidocaine and epinephrine. Curettage is performed using a 7 mm disposable curette. Curettage is performed in all directions making sure to clear any remaining tumor from the edges. Electrodesiccation is performed using a blunt tip disposable electrode with a power setting of 16 watts on low. The curette is employed again, making sure to use it in multiple directions. Electrodesiccation is performed going back and forth across the affected area. A curette is used once again in all directions, including the edges of the tumor. Final electrodesiccation is performed. The last step includes circumferential electrodesiccation around the entire tumor. Electrosurgery is a versatile and powerful tool in the treatment of many skin lesions. Access to and knowledge of electrosurgery will expand your repertoire of skin treatments available for your patients.